Haiti's government declared a state of emergency on Sunday, following violent clashes, damaged communications and two prison breaks. That as a major gang leader seeks to oust Prime Minister Ariel Henry. A curfew was imposed with immediate effect throughout the West Territory for 72 hours. A dramatic escalation in violence in the capital over the weekend saw armed groups break into the country's largest prison. It was unclear how many inmates were on the run. Sources close to the institution said it was likely an overwhelming majority. Built to hold 700 prisoners, it held 3,687 as of February last year, according to rights group RNDDH. When Reuters visited on Sunday, there were no signs of police officers and the main prison doors remained open. Gang leader Jimmy Cherizier, a former police officer, has called for criminal groups to unite and overthrow Henri. He warned locals to keep children from going to school to avoid collateral damages, as violence surged as the Prime Minister sought support abroad. Nearly 15,000 people have been forced to leave their homes in recent days, according to the UN International Organization for Migration. Prime Minister Henry had previously pledged to step down by February. He later said security must first be re-established in order to ensure free and fair elections. 